you have a beautiful smile. Thank you. When you laugh, when you smile, I think it's really authentic. A viral New York Times article featured 36 questions that could supposedly make any two people fall in love. We wanted to see what would happen if we asked these questions to two complete strangers on a blind date. My name is Karis Givens, and I'm currently single. Somebody who's a good listener, someone who's really kind. I also look for someone who I think can have deep conversations and can take things seriously but also can have fun. I know that's kind of opposite, <laughs> but I like that in someone. My name is Paulo Chun and I'm single. Very single. I feel kind of nervous, kind of anxious, kind of excited and I don't know. Uh, I don't know what to expect who to meet, but I think it's going to be a good time to just get to know a new person. Have you ever been on a blind date before? I've never been on a blind date before. It's my first time. And what are you like most nervous about? Maybe the awkwardness that there will be in the beginning, but I feel like once we get talking, then I think that'll go away. Hi. Hi, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm Paulo. I'm Karis. Hi, Karis. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. <sighs> Are you from LA area? Or? Originally, I'm from Brazil. Oh, Brasileiro. Brasileiro, nice. yes. Oi, tudo bem? Oi, tudo. <laughs> How do you know Portuguese? I live here for two months. Really? Yeah, but Why? that's pretty much the extent of what I know. Okay, what yeah. about you? Are you from LA? I'm from um, Orange County. All right. Um, moved from the East Coast with my family when I was really young, so it's pretty much okay. the majority of what I know. All right. All right. Do you want some more tea before we begin? I would love some. More All right. Tea, cool. Actually. All Do right. you like some? Yes, please. <laughs> All right. All right. Do you want to go first? Okay. So, do you have a secret hunch about how you will die? I know how I want to die, yeah. like in a way where people are like, that was pretty legendary, you know, that, that's a way to go, you know. What's a legendary I don't way know. to go? I don't know, like saving someone's life, oh, okay. really dramatic, yeah, really like cool. Korean dramas, you yes, know. Yes, yes. Oh, that's such a good answer. Shoot. How about you? I'm afraid to say it because I don't want to curse myself, you know what I mean? No, don't worry. I've always been afraid that I would die from some sort of disease or really bad car accident. You know, okay. It's Hopefully it'll be quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll be like, oh shoot, I'm really gonna die in a car accident. And, and, then, then, and, then, it. and then that's it. No time to freak out. Yeah, you can't even freak out. It's yeah. so quick. Let's just leave that to God. Um, can I have some more tea, please? Yes. <laughs> Stressed from that. <laughs> when did you last sing to yourself or to someone else? <laughs> like 15 minutes ago? <laughs> in the car? In the car? Yeah, I was listening to some Whitney Houston. What about you? Last time I sang to myself, maybe in the shower. Sometimes I'll, I'll be driving and my sister's next to me. And then right. when I start singing, she's like, can she's you like, stop? <laughs> You're embarrassing me. So does that mean that you can show me a little dance move right now? I think it would just be like a, sh a, a shoulder. You know, like just like, oh. Like a little shimmy. Yeah, just shimmy right yeah. here. You'll be like right next to another car. I'll yeah, be like, yeah. hey, what's up? <laughs> you know, so I think that would be enough. Okay, for what in your life do you feel most grateful? I think most grateful for my family. Mm. Very grateful for my parents, my siblings too. I think as a whole, we kind of like complement each other and complete each other. How many siblings do you have? I'm the oldest. Oh. And then I have a brother, okay. a sister, and then a little brother. Three boys and one girl. Yeah, she suffers a little bit, but. That's crazy. Mine is three girls and one boy. <laughs> Dude, this is weird. Who set up this blind date? Seriously. Pretty good casting in this Gosh. blind date. Every year for the past three years, me and my siblings have been doing a New Year's video um, just for fun. That's awesome. And then we post it on Instagram. <laughs> All right. Let's see this. Oh my goodness. Oh my. <laughs> you guys do this every year? We started like three years ago. Now it's starting to become sort of like a tradition. But yeah, that's... That was amazing. That's my, that's me and my siblings, yeah. Thank you so much for showing me that. Okay. Name three things you and your partner appear to have in common. Okay. We can do this one together. Korean. I'm half Korean. Um, 
We've both been to Brazil. Yes. You mentioned your dad's a pastor. Mm -hmm. Okay, my dad's a pastor too. Stop it. Oh my, uh, okay, PKs. So, PKs, yo. Yo, <laughs> we should cheers to that. Cheers, cheers to the PKs. Yeah, all the PKs out there. Next okay. question. We're good at this. If you can wake up tomorrow having gained any one quality or ability, what would it be? Do you have one? Fearlessness. Whoa. Just so I can see, see how much of it holds me back. Maybe not much will, but that'd be interesting. Can I have to rethink mine? <laughs> Maybe mine was too superficial. It's like, whoa, fearlessness. No, you say that one too, though. Okay, um, I wish I could fly. Oh, shoot. The feeling of being able to fly would be awesome. Is there something that you've dreamed of doing for a long time? Why haven't you done it? I think I haven't, do I dream about it? I guess it's a desire. Um, I've wanted to somehow uh, be in a movie. Even if I die on that scene or I just come out, I'm like, hey, and get shot. <laughs> Maybe that's like a small dream, but yeah. like, it's, it's something it. that like, oh, I, I think it would be interesting, you know? Similar to yours, I think mine was doing something in film or TV. I've always been afraid to do it because it felt very vulnerable. Yeah, we have like one life. Yeah. We don't have that much time. Exactly. Just gotta take the chances and do it. Um, what is your most terrible memory? I got arrested at a checkpoint. I was 19. I remember sitting in handcuffs on the curb, like tearing up and just thinking, how am I gonna tell my parents? Mm -hmm. What's gonna happen next? Big life lesson for me. Dang. Yeah, I'm that up. PK. Oh, you're yeah. that PK. Mm -hmm. Okay, I know you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, terrible memory. The one I can think of right now, I was on set and I was kind of like learning. Everything I did, like, didn't work out. So like, hey, can you shoot this? Then I would accidentally step on something, something would fall. No. Boom, so I was like, oh my goodness, like who brought this guy? Like I almost teared up. I was like, oh my goodness, this is so hard. But then it turned into something really positive later because I was like, wow, but I'm so thankful. Despite being super hard, um, I have this opportunity. Alternate sharing something you consider a positive characteristic of your partner. I'll start then. Okay. I really like your energy and openness. I think that's a, a great characteristic to have. Just someone who's a good conversationalist and easy to talk to. I love the fact that you talked about, like, I want to be fearless, but I feel like you already are. Like, you do a lot of things. You, you don't want to regret it, and you just do it. You're a family guy. You mm -hmm. really care about your family, and it's very evident that you guys are close. I don't know how many times I talk to people who are at least openly grateful for mm -hmm. their parents and for their siblings, so that's cool. You have a beautiful smile. Thank you. When you laugh, when you smile, I think it's really authentic. Would you go on a second date with your partner? Do we time this, the answer, or? Okay, go first. I'll go first. I would. There seems to be other factors involved in, in dating. Do you want to get to know someone? Yeah. Do you want to hear more about their story in a safe setting? And yeah, I would totally do that. I would totally ask you out on a second date. I feel like um, we really connected. We had like a what? An hour, an hour and a half to talk right yeah. now. But I know there's so much more that you yeah. have to share. Yeah, I don't know what's after this. <laughs> But I guess like, yeah, we could set up a time or something mm -hmm. while I'm still here. Yeah, and we can meet up. sounds good to me. Cool. Cool. I want to see another video. Okay, yeah. Your... Oh, let me, let me, let me <laughs> find the other last one. Year. <laughs> I feel like I've seen this. <laughs> I feel like I love your sister already. Yeah, my sister's pretty crazy. I, I think you would get along with my sister. Is she in here? Is she here or? No, she's in Brazil. Brazil. Hey guys, it's Taylor. And I'm Jason with Jubilee. Thanks for watching that episode of Tea for Two. Uh, we want to ask you another question for the comments below. Complete this sentence. I wish I had someone with whom I could share. I wish I had someone whom I could share this video with. It's <laughs> a good one. <laughs> Let us know your answer below. Um, and as always, make sure you subscribe and click to watch more videos. And we will see you next time.
Hey guys, guess who I'm with? Karis! Yeah, <laughs> we did go on the second date. Indeed, we did. It was horrible. What? <laughs> Just kidding, we've been talking for hours. Nobody's here anymore. See, it's everybody's crazy. like gone. But yeah, it was super fun. Yes, ate some great fun. It was delicious. Bye. <laughs>